Listen and practice. My father is a doctor. He works in a hospital for children in Paris. He works very hard, but he loves his job. He's a very kind person. I miss him a lot because I live in England. But when he comes home, he always brings me something nice. I love my grandmother very much. She doesn't get angry with me like my parents do sometimes. And she always wants to listen to what I say. She is 74 years old and lives with my aunt and uncle in the same town as me. I see her every weekend. My brother is four years younger than me, but he goes to the same school as me. He has blonde hair and is quite small for his age. I have a notice on my door at home that says, Private, but he comes in without knocking. So annoying. But he is very funny sometimes too. Uncle Harry is an actor. He's often on TV. He lives in London, but he often comes to see us. He's my mother's brother, and he's an interesting person. I like to talk to him about films and TV programmes. He's a wonderful storyteller. My father is a doctor. My father is a doctor. My father is a doctor. He works in a hospital for children in Paris. He works in a hospital for children in Paris. He works in a hospital for children in Paris. He works very hard, but he loves his job. He works very hard, but he loves his job. He works very hard, but he loves his job. He's a very kind person. He's a very kind person. He's a very kind person. I miss him a lot because I live in England. I miss him a lot because I live in England. I miss him a lot because I live in England. But when he comes home, he always brings me something nice. But when he comes home, he always brings me something nice.
but when he comes home, he always brings me something nice. I love my grandmother very much. I love my grandmother very much. I love my grandmother very much. She doesn't get angry with me like my parents do sometimes. She doesn't get angry with me like my parents do sometimes. She doesn't get angry with me like my parents do sometimes. And she always wants to listen to what I say. And she always wants to listen to what I say. And she always wants to listen to what I say. She is 74 years old. She is 74 years old. She is 74 years old. and lives with my aunt and uncle in the same town as me. And lives with my aunt and uncle in the same town as me. And lives with my aunt and uncle in the same town as me. I see her every weekend. I see her every weekend. I see her every weekend. My brother is four years younger than me. My brother is four years younger than me.
My brother is four years younger than me. But he goes to the same school as me. But he goes to the same school as me. But he goes to the same school as me. He has blonde hair and is quite small for his age. He has blonde hair and is quite small for his age. He has blonde hair and is quite small for his age. I have a notice on my door at home that says private. I have a notice on my door at home that says private. I have a notice on my door at home that says private. But he comes in without knocking. But he comes in without knocking. But he comes in without knocking. So annoying. So annoying. So annoying. But he is very funny sometimes too. But he is very funny sometimes too. But he is very funny sometimes too. Uncle Harry is an actor. Uncle Harry is an actor. Uncle Harry is an actor. He's often on TV. He's often on TV. He's often on TV. He lives in London, but he often comes to see us.
He lives in London, but he often comes to see us. He lives in London, but he often comes to see us. He's my mother's brother, and he's an interesting person. He's my mother's brother, and he's an interesting person. He's my mother's brother, and he's an interesting person. I like to talk to him about films and TV programs. I like to talk to him about films and TV programs. I like to talk to him about films and TV programs. He's a wonderful storyteller. He's a wonderful storyteller. He's a wonderful storyteller. Listen and practice. My father is a doctor. He works in a hospital for children in Paris. He works very hard, but he loves his job. He's a very kind person. I miss him a lot because I live in England. But when he comes home, he always brings me something nice. I love my grandmother very much. She doesn't get angry with me like my parents do sometimes. And she always wants to listen to what I say. She is 74 years old and lives with my aunt and uncle in the same town as me. I see her every weekend. My brother is four years younger than me but he goes to the same school as me. He has blonde hair and is quite small for his age. I have a notice on my door at home that says private, but he comes in without knocking. So annoying. But he is very funny sometimes too. Uncle Harry is an actor. He's often on TV. He lives in London, but he often comes to see us. He's my mother's brother, and he's an interesting person. I like to talk to him about films and TV programs. He's a wonderful storyteller. Listen and practice. I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs, and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and online. My sister is more interested in the arts. 
She likes music and she loves to read. She hates computers. I'm very interested in computers. I'm very interested in computers. I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs and I have a lot of great software. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs and I have a lot of great software. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and online. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and online. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and online. My sister is more interested in the arts. My sister is more interested in the arts. My sister is more interested in the arts. She likes music and she loves to read. She likes music and she loves to read. She likes music and she loves to read. She hates computers. She hates computers. She hates computers. Listen and practice. 
I'm very interested in computers. I'm always teaching myself new computer programs, and I have a lot of great software. My brother and I spend all our free time in computer stores and online. My sister is more interested in the arts. She likes music and she loves to read. She hates computers. Listen and practice. I'm a carpenter. I work eight hours a day from Monday to Friday. I get up around 6 a.m. and I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I go to bed at 10. I'm a carpenter. I'm a carpenter. I'm a carpenter. I work eight hours a day. I work eight hours a day. I work eight hours a day. From Monday to Friday. From Monday to Friday. From Monday to Friday. I get up around 6 a.m. I get up around 6 a.m. I get up around 6 a.m. And I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. And I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. And I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I go to bed at 10. I go to bed at 10. I go to bed at 10. Listen and practice. I'm a carpenter. I work eight hours a day from Monday to Friday. I get up around 6 a.m. and I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I go to bed at 10. Listen and practice. Well, I'm an accountant. It's a regular 9 to 5 office job, so I get up at 7 a.m. and get home around 6 p.m. That's okay, though, because I like to go out at night. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. Well, I'm an accountant. 
Well, I'm an accountant. Well, I'm an accountant. It's a regular nine to five office job. It's a regular nine to five office job. It's a regular nine to five office job. So I get up at seven AM. So I get up at seven AM. So I get up at seven AM. And get home around six PM. And get home around six PM. And get home around six PM. That's okay though, because I like to go out at night. That's okay though, because I like to go out at night. That's okay though, because I like to go out at night. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. Listen and practice. Well, I'm an accountant. It's a regular nine to five office job. So I get up at seven AM and get home around six PM. That's okay though, because I like to go out at night. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. Listen and practice. Well, my hours are a bit different. I'm a nurse. I start work at 11 at night. I work until 7 a.m. I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30, and I sleep until 4 p.m. Oh, you know, I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. It's a great schedule for me. Well, my hours are a bit different. Well, my hours are a bit different. Well, my hours are a bit different. I'm a nurse. I'm a nurse. I'm a nurse. I start work at 11 at night. I start work at 11 at night. I start work at 11 at night. I work until 7 a.m. I work until 7 a.m. I work until 7 a.m. I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30. 
I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30. I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30. And I sleep until 4 p.m. And I sleep until 4 p.m. And I sleep until 4 p.m. Oh, you know, I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. Oh, you know, I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. Oh, you know, I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. It's a great schedule for me. It's a great schedule for me. It's a great schedule for me. Listen. And practice. Well, my hours are a bit different. I'm a nurse. I start work at 11 at night. I work until 7 a.m. I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30. And I sleep until 4 p.m. Oh, you know, I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. It's a great schedule for me.